Welcome to now everybody. Today's practice is going to be two parts. Number one. Number one, we are going to find out what would happen if we got the news that we're dying in one hour. There's no way around it. What would you do? So look at yourself in the mirror and go through the practice of imagining what it would be like if you were dying in one hour. What comes up? What would you do? What would you think? That alone is a practice within itself. So go ahead and do that. Two, the more advanced version is to actually meditate on death. Lay down in your bed or on the floor and tell yourself, I am dying, I am dying, I am dying. And do this until you start to lose sensation in your arms. You're gonna to start to feel everything getting heavy and maybe even cold. And the purpose of these two drills is to switch out of the sensation of the mind. So the mind is a sensation, it is not us. I studied psychology and Western psychology. We feel like the mind is us. If you look over in the East, they're not concerned with psychology because psychology is uh, of the mind is a, uh, they view that as a sensation. And what's really important is what's beyond the mind, what's outside of the mind. And the purpose of this second drill of, of the dying meditation is to transcend the body, to transcend the mind. When you're at the point where you feel, when you're feeling completely energyless, like the physical body has no more energy, the mind has no more energy, allow yourself to step outside of that construct that we we live in the majority of the time, that construct. You know the word ecstasy? It means in English to stand outside. And what it's referring to is to stand outside of oneself, to be in ecstasy. So we're not meditating on death in a, in a negative way. In fact, death is not negative at all. It's something that we're all in the process of doing. We are all dying. And... In many cultures, death is revered. The, it's something to look forward to, but not something to dwell on and have anxiety about. But it's something we're going towards. You know, our birthday is just, our death day is just as important as our birthday. Anyways, okay, two. I'm rambling on and on. I'm trying to keep these short. Two, uh... What if you're dying in an hour? What do you do? How do you feel about that? Look in the mirror when you're doing this. I just did it in that mirror right there. It was awesome. And then two, if you're up for it, I am dying, I am dying, I am dying. Make sure you don't have emotional attachment to the anxiety of dying. We don't wanna do any accidental manifestations. Awesome. Have fun with that, you guys, and remember that this is all about figure, uh, feeling outside, that ecstasy.